test this smart card. Um, and again, we've been over it. You have no jets, so it's very simple and uh, really easy to install, easy to use. Oh, look, there's Paul. Hi, Paul. All right, so let's see, guys. You know what? Before I take this off, I should just see if it even clears these uh, the cases. Hey, smart carb slide, 70, 75 mile an hour bike. Pretty just interested in seeing what the what this thing runs like after with the carb. Fuel lines on, choke stays out while the bowl's filling. Okay, see how she runs. We have an opportunity to test this smart card. So this customer decided to pick up a smart card from us. Um, and again, we've been over it. You have no jets. Your only adjustment is this knob up here, your idle speed. Um, so it's very simple and uh, really easy to install, easy to use. He has a Fellini 24. He's running a Corsa on this, a Melosi crank, an Arrow. Obviously, he's got the clutch and variator and all that good stuff. Gonna get a number, just how this sits right now. See how the tune is, should be pretty close. And then um, gonna go ahead and put this guy on here. So not only should he get some horsepower gains with this, uh, he should also get some better throttle response, better mid-range, kind of smoother. And then he should also get 30% better fuel economy, which is a pretty big deal on these bikes since they drain fuel. Let me get this hooked up, run it, see what we make, and then just do a quick swap, show you guys how easy and how fast it is. Let's so change these carbs out. And this is actually our one we got from Smart Carver as a prototype, and uh, people are already starting to buy them, so we do have them coming right now. And keep in mind that um, depending on your specific application, you need to put in the notes what bike you have and all that good stuff because what we do is rather than just buying one off the shelf, we actually send the information to Smart Carb and they build them out specifically catered to your application. It comes with paperwork and everything too. Pretty sweet. We're gonna see how this guy works, see make sure it clears everything. When someone asks me how much money I have spent on my bike, somewhere between 700 billion and a trillion 300 million billion dollars. Maybe a little tight, but let's find out. Oh look, there's Paul. Hi Paul, it's Hi. nice out. How's she run? It really is easier now. Okay, I just have one question about this hotel before I sign up. Can I ask that question? Uh, so the the question is, I want to take your wife and her, and then uh, nine months later when the pops out, I want be for like lunch. Is that something I could do there in the hotel? You ever had a deep You there? Turn it on first. Hey Paul, how do you grab something? Sure? Yeah, sure about this? Because I didn't want to take this apart more than once. Where is the cable? Up front. I grounded it. It just needs... That sounds good. I know. Dang. That sounds really good. It's a ported Corsa. She's hungry. Rotor. Oh, the, the rotor is where it's at. It revs up quick. Yeah, this should be a good, this should be a good example. Wow. It sounds good.
on right now. I... I have it on. I remember putting jet flight. Well, that's what I'm saying. If it was 118 and choked on, I couldn't even run. You sure you put a main in it? I... Honestly, I couldn't say constantly that's what I put in. I feel like that's what I would have put in, but I don't remember if I actually did it. Okay. Because it's been like three weeks. <laughs> what, does it seem lean? Well, it should be making a lot more power than that. I'll check the jet, because eight is, it should be like 10. 10. But yeah. we don't know who ported it. No. He said he did it. He said he did it? He said he did it. I mean, it didn't look bad. No, I'll, I'll look... check the, I'll check what it is. It takes two seconds to do. Yes. Oh, happy. stinky. All right, so we have a uh, 114 in here now. Let's see how it runs. Let's see how it runs. It's, we got eight with a 116, so. Uh, MCY uh, Stater. So we got eight before. get a little bit more you can probably get nine and a half ten which is about typical we end up with with these is about uh eight and a half to ten and a half somewhere in there so it's right about where it should be so let's get that other carb on it's 9.01 that's probably about right be a little higher but like you said it was ported and, and who's to say whether or not it was done right yeah it runs good though it runs strong all right so let's see guys what time is it 347 I need you to jet this Navi for me. Okay, let's do this. Uh, for now, um, I'm going to, I'm not too sure about the choke yet. If I want to uh, try to work with that remote choke, ultimately I don't think it's a big deal. But you know what, before I take this off, I should just see if it even clears these, uh, the cases. Because that would be a bummer if it didn't. Ooh, that's sexy. Woo, she's sexy, Paul. Smart carb, it should be called sexy carbs. Do you want to start a business? We we'll call them Paul carbs? No? Paul's upset right now. Paul, if you don't want to mess with that carb anymore, we could... Okay. Paul's giving up on the oh, Navi carb. Well, you said it, it wheelies better now, right? So. Maybe I just try harder. Maybe it's breaking in. So now what I'm gonna do here is see if the throttle cable, where am I blind? There it is. Nope. Wait. There it is. 
All right, let's see if the throttle cable is going to work. All right. Hey, smart carb slide. Isn't that weird? I'm taking this mirror off because it's just weird. Mm. Woo! Hot rod. Oh, perfect. Perfect. Kind of no matter what you do with a bike like that, it's just always going to be slow. Which is fine. As long as you understand that it's a slow bike and you didn't buy a fast bike. This is going to be way too long. Oh! We're gonna take some slack out of here right now. Otherwise, have some problems. Our S23 throttle cables have an adjustment in the middle, which is nice. And they have one up there at the top. So, take some of the slack out. I think it still needs quite a bit of slack to come out, but let's uh, let's just see what we can do here. Yeah, look at that. So we gotta try to find a way to take that all out. So hindsight, probably a 90 would be really good. See if I can make it work. We're just testing right now, so let's see here. I forgot there's a bunch of slack in here because it's not hooked up to the twist throttle yet. We have the throttle cable disconnected right now because we don't want to pull the headset apart quite yet because we're waiting on the parts to do the disc brake swap on this uh, this guy. This should be a 75, 70, 75 mile an hour bike. Pretty reliable, nothing crazy. Um, just interested in seeing what the what this thing runs like after with the carb. And once this is off, the Navi is gonna go on the dyno. He's gonna be cursing it when he gets back here. He says it's 2022 CH80, and that's not a compliment. So it's gonna go away, it's out of here. Put that in there for now. Fuel line's on, choke stays out while the bowl's filling, so that's something you gotta do. So, good fit, I have to say. It's actually almost, yeah, I'd say it feels a little more compact than a PWK, but it, it can't be. Just, I don't know why it feels like it's compact, maybe just because it's square, not sure. Pretty sure he wants to run this car regardless, but. Okay, so what you do to set the fuel amount, uh, you fill the bowl first then you're supposed to hold it wide open and push the cap down here okay see how she runs idle up a little bit. a little rich, so I get a little rich right now. Well, let's see what it does. Yeah. 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 
It feels like it's too late, rich, but maybe it's not. So I'm five clicks richer. <laughs> Thank you.